Hi everyone, this is Andy with Blunga.com and today we're going to review Pipedrive CRM. This tool is packed with features and will help you with your deals, leads and contact tracking. And it also connects to your email and calendar so you can track all that directly from Pipedrive. Let's start. It is important that the software we use is well designed and easy to use. Pipedrive has a really nice design and the layout is very organized, giving you easy access to the parts you will be using the most. When you log into Pipedrive, you start in the Deals module, where you can see all the deals organized by stage. You can also see some basic information about each deal. When you click on any of them, it will open the record where you can find all the information about it. On the top, you will see the stages. On the left column, you will find more info as well as related records like organizations, contacts and more. And on the center, you will find all activities related to this record. You can also create activities here as well. On the very left of the screen, you can find a menu that you can use to navigate to the other modules. Just click on any of them to open it, but keep in mind that you can also use the shortcuts. Inside the contacts module, we have people as well as organizations. To add a new person, click on the button and complete the required fields. Finally, on the top of the screen, you will find the search bar as well as a quick add button. And on the top right corner, you will find more options, including your profile and the settings, tools, and automations. This CRM is packed with cool features, so let's review the ones I like the most. In the leads module, you can keep all your leads before converting them into a deal. And you will also find this subsection called Lead Booster that allows you to add a live chat to your website, create web forms that you can use in your website as well, and also add a tracking code so you can gather more information about your leads. Another feature I like is that you can sync your email and calendar to Pipedrive and then use it as your default email and calendar client. This way, it is easy to create new deals and contacts directly from an email and schedule meetings with your contacts. The next feature I want to mention is Propose Time. Here you can create a link that you can share with your contacts so they can book a meeting with you. Once they pick the time, an event gets created and added to your calendar. The last feature I want to mention is Important Fields. This feature allows you to select what fields are important for your sales process, and if the field is not filled, it will show on the top left corner of the screen. I think Pipedrive has all the features you need to manage your leads, contacts, and deals. Let's talk about customization. You will be able to modify and add new pipelines, as well as add and customize fields for your leads, contacts, and deals modules. You can also customize the lead booster features that I mentioned before, so they match your company branding and fit your sales process. Another thing that you can customize is the activity types that you will be able to use, like calls, meetings, tasks, and more. And like I mentioned before, you can edit or add fields to the different modules, but that's about it. The customization level is similar to other CRMs like Hotspot and ActiveCampaign, but for example, it doesn't allow you to create custom modules, which is a great feature for companies that have a specific sales process and need more than the basic modules. Automations are really important these days. There are many tasks that can be automated and save lots of time. Pipedrive uses workflows to automate basic actions like creating tasks, sending emails, and more. In the Automations module, you will find a lot of predefined workflows that you can use right away, or you can also create your custom workflows using the button in the top right corner. There are a lot of different triggers that you can select, like when deal has been updated, created, or deleted, when the person has been updated, created, or deleted, and more. Then you can set some conditions to filter which records will trigger this workflow, and finally you can set up the actions. Unfortunately, there are no conditional functions available, so you won't be able to use things like if, then, wait, and other functions that are available in other CRMs. Okay, let's review the integrations. In the settings, you will find the integration submenu where you can find a list of apps that have a native integration and have been working with Pipedrive for a long time, like MailChimp and Slack. But Pipedrive also has a marketplace where you can find all the apps that have an integration available. Here you will find other apps like Zapier, Zoom, Pandadoc, QuickBooks, and more. Overall, I think that all the basic integrations are covered. 
The marketplace doesn't have a lot of apps yet, but the most popular apps are available already and the marketplace will keep growing. If you're the one that is going to implement this CRM in your organization, you're going to have an easy time. The setup process is super simple and there are a lot of videos in every part of Pipedrive that explain how to do things. Managing users is simple but robust. You will have the option to add users, create roles, create groups, and also create teams. This will allow you to control what information each employee can see in a really detailed way. Adding fields and labels is really simple as well. And creating automations is also simple because the workflows you're going to be able to set up are not too advanced. Now let's review the price. The plan I was using during this demo was the professional one, that is $59 per user per month. This is not the less expensive CRM out there, but the price is similar to other CRMs that have less features than Pipedrive. Another good option if you are starting is the advanced plan, that is $33 per user per month. It doesn't have the user permission features, but it is great to start. I think that the pricing is similar to other CRMs out there, but also keep in mind that some of them are more advanced than Pipedrive in some aspects. And there are others that have less features but are more affordable. I had a lot of fun setting up Pipedrive and trying all the features. I would recommend it to any small or medium company that are looking for a really nice CRM that works great out of the box without having to customize it or changing too many things. The features cover all the basic CRM needs and the setup process is very simple. They also have a great knowledge database where you can find a lot of information about the CRM and the Academy website where you can find a lot of information about sales and how to use the CRM. If Pipedrive is too expensive for you, I would try HubSpot, which is free, but the features are basic. More features are available, but you will have to pay for that. Another alternative, in case you're looking for a more customizable CRM, is Soho CRM Plus, which is around the same price, but has a lot of more features available. All right, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and if you did, please leave a thumbs up. I have a question for you. Are you currently using a CRM? And if you do, which one are you using? Let me know in the comments down below. And also remember to check out the other videos I have on this channel. Thanks for watching.